Hello, the internet saffron here. Going back into the not game. <laughs> the not game game. And here we are trying to get Mr. Glitch off of Mr. Wilhelm. And we just got a recipe for snow, a cherry, and we need a full moon. So we got to figure out how to do said things. So let's start looking around. Okay, so there is a moon here. And then there's this stuff here. And I didn't see like a cherry anywhere. User oh! Ice cream. Maybe it can be used as snow. After all, it's just water in a solid state. Okay. How can we get it? All right, well, we got to get the, the tongue, apparently. At any rate, that ice cream okay, so how do we get that? These cans of paint make me think of the three primary colors. Aha. Uh -huh. Blue and yellow. Except we're inside a cathode ray screen with a video signal, <laughs> which is a CTR. Blue and green. Yes. Uh, without a paintbrush, there's no point anyways. Why are you talking about mixing colors? Gee, I don't know why. Oh! I didn't mean to hit that. I didn't... Um, okay, you go back in. Sorry. I saw, I hit the video connection. My bad. Okay, um... So how do we get a full moon? Okay, so he's talking about mixing colors. So let's move the moon. Someplace where we can utilize it. Oh wait! Oh look at that! Oh look at that! And the award for Unscrewer of the Year goes to the user. And now I have a tongue. For you. So, <laughs> well, I'm so glad the game is deciding to work with me here. All right, so now we have a tongue. We can get ice cream. Well done, Jim. All that's left is the cold. Sorry. I don't know. Got on hand is a game and, a TV. and the TV. And I just, I did that. I did this thing. No. It's television no. snow. <laughs> I'm impressed. You All know. you young kids wouldn't Let's remember that. This snow will do the trick. Aha, uh -huh. so we'll plug that back in. Okay, so now we have our ice cream. Okay, and then we need a full moon and a cherry. Whoops, okay, let's go back here. Okay, in the full moon, we were gonna put the, whoops. I was gonna bring the moon back here. Okay, so how do we paint it though? Was this here? Can I paint with my hand? We paint with the tongue? Okay, apparently you can't dip your tongue in the paint. That's a bad idea. Um, I can't imagine the magnifying glass. Well, okay. The eyeball. Can I paint the ice cream too? No. Okay, so the eyeball, we need yellow and blue. No, green and red make yellow. Okay, so then we should be able to paint the moon, right? Did it have to be in the other area? I would think yellow would be the color of the moon, right? Maybe it's white? I lick... I lick the moon? Okay, so I can lick the moon. But I can't...
Okay, so then let's maybe maybe we gotta make it white. Oh, a big red bowl, like a juicy cherry. Do you think it will do the trick? Let's hope so. Oh, well, that's what it was. Was it wasn't what it what it was uh, planning. Okay, so. Okay, so whoops, I didn't want to do that. Whatever I did. Okay, so I. Okay, so me may, maybe we gotta put the moon back. I don't know. But I couldn't... I couldn't paint the tongue, could I? Oh! Well, there it did. Okay. Alright, yeah, I did that before and it didn't work. Okay, so yeah, so then... Okay. So now we can make a full moon. Got it. Fantastic full moon. I hope the game won't get wise to us. It doesn't. It's fine. It's fine. Holmes, I'm completely oh, yeah. in the dark. I'm terrified. Yes, excellent. <laughs> if you see my magnifying glass, let me know. I hate you. <laughs> right, because it's completely dark. He can see it. All right. So we'll put the full moon back, and now we have I uh, we have ice cream, and we have a cherry. All right. Clap. There you go. Sorry, Mr. Wilhelm. It's for your own good. I think. Right? Okay, we have all the ingredients. Why isn't anything happening? Something seems to be happening. Look, it's starting. Mr. Wilhelm just exploded like a beached whale. That's a terrible analogy. I'm finally free of that radical sprite. This trip has been more difficult than imagined. Mr. Glitch! Game, you again? Yes, hello! Did you follow me? Well, we were transported here by I was gonna say, we didn't really try to follow you. No, it can't be true. You brought the user with you. You're such a pain in the neck. And you wonder why she left you. <laughs> I won't let you speak of her. GG. I, I have to go. This isn't the dimension I was aiming for. So, good game. <laughs> oh. No, we have to I was going to say, that looks like he just blocked our exit. Painting just blocked away. And I feel like it's backwards. Are you talking about your trousers, my good man? <laughs> How are we going to get past it? Okay, well... Let's just see here. There's something we can do in the back first. Do not touch this piece of bug, user. Oh! I didn't even see that little piece of bug. Okay, is this... Like, do I have hints on or something, or is that really how the game is supposed to be here? Let me look. Alright, so... Yeah, I didn't even see that little piece of bug. Oh! We fixed it. The painting is the right way round. At least I think so. I have no idea. <laughs> Come, Holmes. Let's follow the rainbow ghost. Come then, Watson. It's probably just a large flying insect. So, if I understand right, some things seem to be affected by this bug fragment. Uh Aha! -huh. It's like it reverses them or something. Uh, who cares? Let's follow them. Okay. So, like, maybe this cup up here. Or maybe this here? Okay, all right. Well, we'll keep going then. Where is the exit? I can feel it here. Take us home. But why, game? You're not happy here with your new NPCs. NPC? <laughs> oh, did not know that. <laughs> Sorry, I meant new friends. <laughs> new friends. Watson, stop conversing with this beast. You're making me uneasy. Your AI doesn't seem too great. <laughs> yeah. To, go, Mr. Glitch? to a place where I will be able to unleash my evil plan. What plan? The one that will let me. What? 
Uh, what? what? A copy projection system right in the middle of a game? How barbaric. We're missing the explanation of his evil plan. <laughs> ah, let's find the numbers we need fast. Oh, research. interesting. Okay, so we're looking at a cane and whatever that thing is. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on. What the heck was this? Oh, so I can move it. Okay. A three digit code, but it has to match. There's a skull. Do you think this copy protection system really existed? I doubt it was There's a green, red, and a blue. Okay, so what corresponds? On the other hand, it must if I do the skull and the scissors, green and blue would be two and five. Oh, aha. Okay, okay. I, I see what's going on here. But I don't know what the first... Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, so red would be seven. But I can't make a seven upside down. Okay, okay, okay. Or can I? What is one upside down? Okay, one isn't anything upside down, but two is five. Four isn't anything either. Okay, so I can make a three-digit combination... I have five numbers. So it has to be one through five. Okay, so here we go. Okay. And I just want to make sure there isn't any other combination. Could these glitch fragments be of any use to us? Okay, so a gun feather and scissors. Okay, which which way is it though? So red Okay, so the green has to be the feather. Is that right? Cuz then they have the skull in the book. So red is 3, green is 1, blue is 5. Okay, red is three, green is one, blue is five. Okay, but the two pictures, the two pictures have to match also? Please enter the number that goes with each picture. But it only gives you two pictures. Okay. Green is a Feather blue is the scissors? Okay, but that we don't have that. Let's think about this. Yeah, because it has to be... It has to be 1, 3, and 5. Three, three, one, five. Okay, so it has to be 3, 1, 5. Cross! Cr cross! Please enter the number that goes with each picture. But there's only two pictures. Oh, there we go. I got it. Sweet. Okay. What an evil plan, isn't it? Uh, could you say that again? We got cut off. No. <laughs> I just saw the exit, which means this is where we say goodbye. Farewell, game. Enjoy your new cardboard home. 
Okay. Farewell, Rainbow Butterfly. <laughs> he disappeared into the ground. Yes, I know. How will we be able to follow him? Okay, can, can we glitch it? Okay, we can't glitch it. Let's have a look around this street scenery. All right, Mr. Hint. Ah, there we go. Okay, well, I guess this is where we go? Oh, we gotta probably go around front, eh? The ground isn't there anymore. But where did the characters go? I'm sure they got sucked into the purple vortex of death. Yep, there they are. <laughs> Sherlock, I'm going to fall. Well, we don't want them to fall. The world is ending. Everything is fake. I am fake. Oh, existential crisis. I'm going to get us out of this mess. Darn it. We can't leave them no, like we don't want to leave them like this. Let's try to get them to safety quickly before leaving. Yes, yeah, so let's see if I can't flip it. Let's see, is there some way to put it right up? Well, I guess that's the only thing we can do, right? Oh, <laughs> that's a fat lot of good. Let's see, is there anything in here we can use to help? Oh, there's a bathtub. Perhaps. Maybe we can catch him. Oh, here we go. Yep, yep, yep. Say, so maybe we can catch him in the bathtub. Okay, so we did that. Is that just... Okay, yep. Okay, so then... We have the bathtub, or at least we flipped it. Oh, and if I knock the manhole cover. Yes. It was in the hall of no. We just opened the passage for you. Go ahead, Mr. Holmes. Jump. Quick, get in the hole. For you to land in on the other side. Jump. You're going to have to trust us. Watson, we're going to swing over to the hole. Three, two, one. Well done, Holmes. What an extraordinary leap. <laughs> I like that they didn't show it. I didn't see much because of the screen interference, but the jump animation must have been amazing. <laughs> okay, nice. Yeah. Now that they're safe, we can leave. Goodbye, gentlemen. We apologize for the inconvenience. Let's go! A soundly led quest. We did it! We saved Holmes and Watson! <laughs> okay. Legend of <laughs> Legend of the Secret. Of the secret. <laughs> I love it. Ah, this still isn't our dimension. Hmm, getting home is going to be more complicated than I thought. Nice. Is that a start button? Uh, it looks like a start button. Let's click it. You've been able to interact with the interface of this game. Ah, that will probably help us. I would hope so. <laughs> Now, of course, we start with the good, the bad, and the princess. Chapter 3. Of course, we have our sleeping hero that is nothing like Zelda at all. Oh, and there's a key here. Before I was abandoned. Let's start by waking up this character. That's what you always do in these games. Right? Hero. Hello. Wake up. Link. Link. Oh, yeah, I kind of figured it was something with this. You've been asleep for a hundred years. If I yell any louder, I might saturate my voice. That's okay, let me take care of this. See, there he's awake. What was that? Nothing? Uh, we've got to read it. He's not even voiced. <laughs> Voiced. That voice, is that you, Gaia, Spirit of the Earth? Uh, yes, yes, it's us. It's me. <laughs> You've got a pretty deep voice for a goddess. I'm not feeling well. <laughs> I have a cold. <clears throat> What's going on? The princess is in danger. Abducted by the infamous Dark Lord. And the held captive in the Menchel Temple. Dimension or? Oh. a way out. Yes, hero, that's it. Let's go rescue her. 
But before we do that, I have to find the 12 sacred feathers scattered all over the world. Yes, of course you do. And slay eight ticklish guardians. <laughs> okay. And find 50 sun fragments. What? Uh, I say we go straight to the dimensional temple. We will figure it out when we get there, okay? Yeah, the key is up here. I can see it. The door is locked. Then go find the key. It must be around here somewhere. Yes, like right here. This one's not the sharpest knife in the drawer. Are all video game characters stupid then? Why are you looking at me? Aha! Where could you have put the key? It's, it's back here. I just got to figure out how to get it. Oh, wait a minute. What's going on here? Are you the one who's making everyone jump, user? Yes. <laughs> hey, look at that. I made a treasure chest appear. Da -da -da -da. That's Grandpa's chest. It was stored in the attic. Well, open it. Maybe the key's inside. Oh, it's back here. Because every hero should start with a giant flicking hammer. That's odd. It looks broken. Looks like Mr. Glitch has been here. Okay, my courage and my will are enough. And a key, especially a key. Yeah, especially need the key. Okay, so now we have a hammer, because what do you do? You break pots, because of course you do. Did the glitchy hammer do this? Uh, I suspect that it shrinks the sprite it hits. <gasps> oh! What do we do with it? I want to make everything in here smaller. I think it'll be great. I know what I'm supposed to be doing. This is more fun. All right, we'll make this smaller and then that gives us the key. Yes. Behind the dresser? Oh crap, dang it. I had to make him jump. I can't reach it. Anything else would have surprised me. User, a little help. Yep, I'm getting it. I'm getting it. There. I've got it. It's about time. <laughs> Go open the door now, hero. Yes, let us sally forth. <laughs> Cause the key's too big. There we go. It's open. Perfect. Imagine that. Can finally get on with the game. The quest, I mean. Okay, I'm sorry. I'll stop. The path of the temple is blocked by these bushes. Do you have anything sharp to get them with? Sword of Life might do it, which is right here. The villagers say it's in the magic clearing to the west. The Sword of Life? Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Sure. Let's get it right here. Uh, careful. There's a hole. I was going to say, I'm going to have to make him jump over the hole, aren't I? Oh, here we are. What happened? Well, I let you die. <laughs> no, I don't think so. I've got to be more careful. Yeah, I guess i got to be more careful. Sorry. A verdant landscape. Oh, well, okay, maybe it was bad timing? What happened? Yes, you fell down the hole. There's one hole in the path, and you fall right in. <laughs> it won't get me this time. They should have called this game Legend of the Lemmings. <laughs> Lemmings. Okay, so can I, maybe I can put this over that? Okay, so he can jump. Is it just going to be a matter of timing? Oh. Don't go falling in that hole again. <laughs> what hole? Just don't move until we find a solution, okay? All right. We're gonna have to cover that hole. Yes. But with what? Well, I only have this big home sign. And this tiny hammer. Wait. Okay, let me see what I can use this hammer on, if anything. Yeah, what is... If we had a board, we could build a bridge. Yes, I get that. 
We have this. We have this up here. Let's try to find a board yes, thank you. Anywhere. I'm looking, game. Even if there's something written on it. Yeah, I said I got this. But it doesn't seem to be the, the solution. What's that bag over on the left? Okay, I don't need hints every time, okay? Let me figure this out. <laughs> okay, sun fragments, sacred feathers, ticklish guardians, and the map. What was that all about? Okay, so what have we got that we can put in there? How come this one is cracked? Okay. It's fine. I figured it out. There. The sword is on the other side of that lake. The villagers say that there's a sunken palace at the bottom of this lake. But since I can't swim, I'll never be able to investigate. Oh, goody. You will probably have to unlock the amphibian skill. Uh, yeah, but wouldn't it be better if I could breathe underwater? Well, that... Okay. No, I'm sure it doesn't have any intel points. <laughs> Alright, so, so then, what else can I, I use in here? Those lily pads are on there by chance. Yeah, yeah. I get it. Lily pads. Oh, I thought I saw something yep. Jump. So did I. It must have been a fish. There. I wasn't dreaming. Nope, I saw it too. He jumped out of the water. Hmm. Okay. Okay, but I already moved that. Oh, okay. So then it'll move to the left. Oh, so I I kind I see what is going on here. We did it. Your chest where did it come from? It looks like the royal chest from the sunken palace. Really? That's what I call rushing a dungeon. <laughs> Yay, we got whatever that is. The monocle, it belongs to the king of the abyss. It looks broken too. That's unfortunate. I hope there's nothing wrong with the sword of life. Wearing a monocle underwater? Already goes. <laughs> anyway. Now it's a sacred treasure. Object. Yes. I wonder what this one does in this world. Yes, that's a very good question. Try it. I'm trying it. Hey, look at that! I made a sunbeam. So it makes things larger. Okay. But then the question is, where do we use it? Because it looks like we can only use it in that one spot, right? Okay. Okay, so then if I do this and I do this. Okay, yeah. So this makes things larger. And I suppose I can only use it once. I can't just keep making it larger. No. Okay. Oh, wait! Oh, look at that! I don't know what good it's for yet, but we can do that. Ah, the monocle on Narja's display. Yeah, I figured that out. <laughs> very interesting. Yes, we figured These that out. These tools are going to be very useful as we move through this world. And of course, you will be able to create chaos as usual. All right, so I have to move this first. Yeah. Oh. The weight of the chest. Oh, okay. There we go. Now we can move this lily pad again. Okay. So... I did too. You shush. Okay. So if we make it smaller, it moves back. Oh. 
Well, it did move back before. Be able to get him across. Couldn't that money call help us? Yes, I, I'm trying. But yeah, I thought that before we just had a moving... Oh. Okay, it depends on what side of the screen I'm on. Okay. You might fall in. If that happens, then someone pushed me. Oh, okay. And I will Dang it. Come. One of these things. Okay, so then if I come back over here, they should both move. All right, then I'll make them bigger. Make this bigger. Yay, we solved it. It's a master sword. Looks more like a copy of Excalibur. Uh huh. It's beautiful. I hope I'm worthy of it. Because of course you are. You're the hero. <laughs> okay. I guess I'm going to have to help him. It's stuck. Oh, come on. Try harder. He doesn't have enough hit points. There must be some muscle underneath those pixels. Okay, is this doing anything? Okay, if I make it smaller. User, you wouldn't happen to have a kind of spinner, oh. would you? Oh. Okay, maybe I gotta make him bigger. I thought maybe if I made the sword smaller. I can feel it move, the sword moved. Yep, okay. Yes, keep it up. Oh, I wasn't talking to you. Okay, we'll get it. Here we go. Yay! Oh, we broke it. Oh. Unbelievable. Oopsie. It's fine. It's fine. Little tape, some super glue, and you won't even know the difference. It also means that this isn't the sort of life. No, because it's up here. I'll never be able to save the princess from the Dark Lord's clutches. All because of some bushes. <laughs> I see your screw detector is still working, but don't try to use that broken sword like a screwdriver. You can see the end doesn't fit. Oh. Unless you can find a way to flatten the end. Sure. Maybe I can use my superhuman strength. Oh, thanks. We saw how that turned out. <laughs> You're right. The end of this sword doesn't fit into the screw. You would need to flatten it. Okay, yep, I figured that. So if I were to flatten it, I could use, like, I would use either this hammer or this. How else could I flatten it? Oh, this thing. Okay, yep, yep, yep. That job completely cracked the tip of the sword. Now there's Sweet. no way we're going to be able to cut anything with. It's fine. That's all we needed it to do. Because now it's a good screwdriver. And now we have the real sword. Another interface, user. In See, I got it figured out. Thank you, Ogaya, for this gift from the gods. Thank you for this. For this. What is it? It's the legendary sword. Yeah, right? Come on. Really? It looks like it's from a galaxy far, far away. Not that far away, believe me. <laughs> but it's just up in the corner. I'm going to try it. Now you can cut those dastardly bushes. It works. Let's go cut those demonic bushes that are blocking our path. Oh, do I have to do this again? I don't believe it. Oh, actually, nice purpose. shortcut. No other I'm all right with that. I actually did it on purpose to save time. Not bad, huh? It's called death abuse. Excellent. So back at the verdant landscape. Through the dastardly bushes. The path to the Menchel Temple is finally clear. All that way to cut down two bushes. Right? Two bushes. Here's one of the infamous Dark Lord's guards. No one gets through, pipsqueak. My master must fulfill the prophecy. <laughs> How original. All right, let's see what this interface, this sword does. Yes. I doubt if it's going to do much. Are you hitting me? 
Okay, well, that didn't work, did it? This is the longest fight ever. Yeah, that sword doesn't seem to be doing anything. Let's let's do this. Doing any damage. Oh, sorry, I dozed off. Okay, so... It sure seems to be that way. Chloe Light! Oh, that's not a good idea. Look at you, you're as small as a bug. I'm gonna crush you. Oh wait, he did a thing up here! Okay. Okay, so I need to move him back. Okay, I need you bigger. You gotta finish breaking whatever this is. Cause then that feather will fall down. Look at that! Hey, he's not gonna stop breaking everything too, is he? What fell down? The feather? Ah, this is no time for tickling. What do you mean it's the perfect time for tickling? That's what you're supposed to do, right? Okay, so I have a feather. You're supposed to tickle the enemies. If I make it smaller, will it continue to float down? Because I thought it was further up. It's a battle of giants! Let me think, let me think. Is there anything else in the bag I can use? Yeah, what does this feather do? Oh, oh, ha <laughs> What was that noise? Aha, I see. Okay, so he's a sneezing. Okay, so if I make him bigger, what if I really have him sneeze? There we go. <laughs> okay, so then if I make it bigger, and there goes the knight. And then if I make it smaller, no, I want to make the... Oh, he's just stuck. <laughs> no, no, we kind of like you right there. This is ridiculous. I have a fight to win. Okay, so yeah, so then... What sort of magic is this? The lily pad's gonna sink. I was kind of hoping that would be the case. I can't swim! Yeah, I was kind of thinking, can I make it smaller? I can't make him bigger. But I can't make the lily pad smaller while he's standing on it. Or it doesn't seem to be the case. Ah, there we go. I just had to make him jump. <laughs> this is what happened to those who dare cross the hero with the legendary sword. Well done, you hero. All that's left to do is to get across that lily pad. That's easy enough. Oh look, it's the Dark Temple! And a bomb! Ooh, kaboomies! This is the entrance to the Dimensional Temple. It's about time. This is where the princess is being held captive. But the passage won't open until I've found the 12 sacred feathers. We're not gonna look for 12 sacred feathers! Forget about that stuff. Look! There's a bomb over there. Yes. We're going to clear the way gracefully. With a giant bomb. Mm, trust me. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Oh, that can't be good. He's going to blow up. Yup. That stings a little. Uh, yeah, your health has decreased. We will have to be careful. Yes. Can you go a little faster there? Yeah, he's gonna blow himself up. Oh, not quite. Oh, I hardly felt the thing. 
I'm, get, I'm getting stronger and stronger. Okay, so if I make that smaller and him bigger. This should be the solution, right? Ah, not quite. Okay, um, so I make... What if I make the bomb bigger? And I make him bigger. Ouch, it's heavy. He's gonna blow up dead. <laughs> Oops. Okay. Alright, so this is... Alright, we're gonna... <laughs> We're gonna have to walk through the whole thing again. Yes, we are. We will walk through the whole thing next time. So thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, ring that bell, subscribe, leave a comment, all that good stuff. Otherwise, I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you all later.